eyes has not seen, nor ears heard, nor have entered into the heart of man the things that God has prepared for those who love him. As we begin this day, let us simply focus on the fact that Jesus paid it all. And when we realize that Jesus has paid it all, we can thank God for life. We can thank God for our health and we can thank God for our strength. And we give God glory for a mind to serve him even in the midst of adversity. The enemy has done a lot of things to us and we must agree that we have done a lot of things to ourselves. But even in the midst of what the enemy has done and what we have done, God's plan for our lives is still active. So we can give God praise for that. We are still alive. And we know that all things work together for the good of those who love God and that are called according to his purpose. So let us rejoice on today that Jesus, he paid it all. May we pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, Lord, we come now thanking you for this another day that you have bestowed upon your servants. We thank you for life. We thank you for health. And we thank you for strength. And right now, as we prepare ourselves to serve, we ask you, Father, to forgive us of our sins. We know that we have made it through many obstacles and many trials. We have made it through issues caused by the enemy, and we have come through issues caused by ourselves. But in the midst of it all, we know that the blood still works. And we thank you, God, for, for allowing us another chance to serve you even in the midst of our imperfections. We thank you for the fact that the plan for our lives is still active. And we know that all things work together for the good, for those who love you and are called according to your purpose. And Lord, we want to give you glory on today as we prepare to serve. We want to give you glory as we equip ourselves. We want to give you glory, Lord, as we strive to be the best that we can be in excellence. We ask you, Lord, to bless every laborer as they prepare themselves on today to serve according to your will and your way. We ask you, Lord, to bless our children. We ask you to bless those who have struggles, those who are sick, and those who have problems in their minds, Lord. We ask you to touch them with your finger of love. We ask you to hold all of us in the palm of your hand. Let us all know individually and collectively that you love us more than anything, Lord. And we will be so careful to give your name the honor and the praise as we strive to work in excellence on today. Be with us, Lord. As we go forth boldly, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever we pray. Amen, amen, amen. And remember, no matter what you're going through, Jesus paid it all. And we can give God praise for that. Have a blessed day.